Okay. Uh, a few more questions for Adam. We've got one over there. Any others from other parts of the room? Okay, we'll start over there. You said the emergency system was working correctly, but when you were in the apartments, there was only a very brief sound, uh, vo voice in English when a lot of the people were from other nations, so they wouldn't even understood it. There was no sirens or, or whooping sounds which you normally hear. So is that how it's supposed to work? Because that made no sense to me that we weren't having this deafening noise that happens when other toaster uh, false alarms were going on. But the day of the fire, we had it was silent. It was just unbelievable. Okay, go for it. <coughs> well, the, the, the type of system, you've got an occupant warning system in the building which is a little bit different than the traditional early warning system. And as a result of the fire, some of the wiring for the, at, that actually connects the sound has got burnt out so that they didn't work. So they didn't work on every particular level. So that's um, sort of going to your question. And the other bit about language, I mean, the, um, the Australian standard here talks about the language that we would use is, is in English. So that doesn't mean that we could change it or facilitate different languages, but the design of it was to cater for the English language. So I guess the question was related to, is that warning system, that's, that's, that's good, it's a good warning system, even though it's not noisy? Like, I guess that's what the question is about. Well, the system that's in the building is a compliance system, so it complies with the regulations. And what, what you can, the takeaway here is that even post, I mean, post the fire, now, now that system's back online, so that's a good thing. But the, on the day of the actual incident, the fire actually impacted on some of the wiring that affected the sounders in some of the apartments. Okay, we've got a question down the back there. Yes, um, again, I'm on the 21st floor, um, opposite in 2102, opposite where the fire went up into the 05 apartments, and um, my, my neighbour who was in 04 knocked on my door at half past two. Uh, by the time I threw some clothes on and went out into the corridor, there were some fire brigade guys on the floor. Um, they said, did I hear anything? There was no sirens going. I said, no. By the time I got down to uh, the ground floor, there was about 20 um, fire brigades down there and ambulances and containers for uh, breathing apparatus already on the ground, so, and the, the snork was up, I thought it must have been uh, going for about half an hour before I got down. So when you said the call, the triple O call was uh, 27 minutes past two, um, I think it must have been uh, earlier than that. But again, there was no sound on our floor at all. Um, that was the concern we had. And um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so there's some concerns about how those early warning systems work if some wiring is affected. And is the noise loud enough for early warning systems? There, there's some of the concerns I'm hearing from those two questions. Would that be right? Have I captured that? Yeah. There was no warning sounds. Yeah. It wasn't a woo, woo. It was nothing. Yeah, and, and that, that it was in, only in English troubled me because the amount of people in our building were foreign. You yeah. mightn't be able to speak English and probably didn't understand what we, what it said. Yeah. Okay, so the lack of sound that people are referring to, Adam, is because the wiring, some of that wiring got burnt. Yeah, is that that's right? correct. That's right. So normally, for a fire, you would get that loud whooping sound. Well, normally you do, and I mean, you, yeah. you've, you've said that it's happened before and you've had um, you know, an alarm go off in the units. Yeah. But this particular time, a unique fire, it took, yeah. the, it took the wiring out of the sound as in it, part okay. of the building. Thanks, Adam. Okay, any other questions for Adam? Last check. Right, okay, thanks Adam. 